So, good morning. How how do you feel? Please share with me how do you feel. Okay, love, 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 Alison. Thank you. Thank you so much. Feel awesome. Thank you so much. And peace. More peaceful. Calm happiness. Yeah, we are here to be happy, to be joyful. Don't be too stressful and have pressure. I want to see more smile in the screen. Oneness, yes. We are here as one. Relaxed, centered, and connected. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, so beautiful. I'm sending you my love here from Bali. Grounded, yes. We need, we need that. <laughs> we need to be grounded to start our day. All right, my beautiful friends, dreamers, leaders all over the world. Let's start creating, co-creating our dreams together. Wow. Okay. So I got that uh, letter from Faith sharing her story about her dreams. <laughs> when she was a child, yeah. And then she made it at the end, right? Most of us have that freedom to dream when we were a kid, when we were a child. Why is that? Why we stop dreaming? Most of us, you know, have found challenging to dream. Thank you for your message. Thank you. Um, I will read this later, but let me focus on my um, session first. I will that, uh, um, answer your question, whatever prayers that I will respond later. But now we're talking about dreams. Why most of us forget to dream? Yeah, we had no boundaries when we were a child. Because we were full of imagination. I remember my father gave me a gift of airplane. And then I start dreaming to travel all over the world. And it happened like fate. He, she dreamed and it happened. I also have a lot of dreams, but I realize also, the more we grow into maturity, going into our professional job and everything, the more we forget to dream because we are busy doing, 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 and survive to be able to survive in this world. We use a lot of our mind, our logic, to achieve what we want, the career, business, everything. And we forget all the imaginations. We forget to dream. And also social judgment. Yeah. A dreamer, they can be, they say that you are unproductive people. There's a judgment in the society for a dreamer. Unproductive, useless, right? Wasting of time. Why don't you do something? Why don't create something? Why don't you work on this? Why don't you focus on your work, business, and build something? You know, make money, create all these things. And, you know. and we have a lot of fears. Because we have to survive during that journey. Whatever age you are. I'm in my 50s. I did all that journey to the corporate life to prove myself that I was the best in this corporate world in doing my job, that I'm successful. Yeah. But it did not bring me joy and happiness. That's why I change, I transform and to create a new dream Actually, this is the perfect time in my age to dream bigger, wilder, and the impossible. 
And I want to share that with you. Because this is powerful. We have to get out from our mind. Our mind is so limited. And I want to share with you, if this is connected to you, to go into the what? You know, go beyond the limit, go to the edge, because we have the power that we forget. It's inside us. We don't get the power from money, from title, from whatever you think outside their reputation. No. It's the power is inside us. That's why I want to invite you to go inside in this session, to co-create our dream. So I want to share this. I don't want to use chart. I'm sorry, Faith Vanessa, because I want to draw this using my imagination and to share this energy direct to you. I hope you can see. The way we do, we create our dream, I want you to reflect. We are now, sorry, this is a lady's uh, drawing, but it doesn't mean only a uh, women gender, it covers all genders, yeah. And then we create our dream. This is we go to the future. And you know what? This is a linear, linear creating of dreams. This is like in where in our corporate job, corporate work, creating strategy, creating flame, plan and goals and what we want to achieve five years from now, for example. You set your goal. You look for formula. You look for plan, strategy, you know, resources to build your dream to make it come true, right? It's all mind-based. And what, not only is mind-based, it is because all of us have this condition that we carry in our life. The condition that created by ourselves, by our parents, by the education system, by the culture, by the society, that limiting us. So reflect on your dream in the moment or in the past. When your dream are created based on these limiting beliefs, on scarcity, on lacking, not good enough, feeling small, you know, cannot show up powerfully as yourself, that you lead your life following some other's dream. If you lead your life following what your parents want, you lead your life from following others' expectations, you know that your future will be limited. It's full of struggling, struggles. Do you experience this? Full of struggles, burn out because we don't know when to stop. We keep working like a machine. Not enough, not good enough, chasing, 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 chasing. Right? This is mind base. You create your dream. I would like to invite you to see the possibilities of creating dream, the other possibilities of co-creating your dream. So this is my chart. So this is very linear, one line time frame. 2025, 2030, you know, you, you, you know, you, you put that time frame. But we forget. 
this is the principle from that I learned. I'm not a scientist, but science is what I'm interested in. And this is based on the quantum energy, quantum power, and based on science proven. And you can read a lot of this from the books, from any uh, materials out there. I learned this, I want to dedicate this to my teacher and mentor, which is Dr. Jean Houston. She is a scholar, researcher or hum on human capacity. And from that, I practice this and I share this with you. So while we, we create our dream, it's based on the quantum energy. This is quantum field. Around you, there is quantum field. And we are actually an energy. Yeah, We are energy. Don't forget it. We are not, although you see this as a solid body, but inside us, everything is energy. And we connect to the field around us. That's why you said about collective consciousness where is collective consciousness collective consciousness is inside us and around us that's why we connect with each other to this collective consciousness and there are a lot of intelligence in this quantum field yeah so everything is around us and the, based on the quantum physics We as a human, we are part of the universe and the universe actually is inside us. We are part of the universe and universe is inside us. Can you close your eyes and imagine universe is inside you? We are operating the same, the same way. How human creating is the same with universe created. Right? And there is future and now and the past are simultaneous. Everything running at the same time. So this is the way that I would like to introduce to, to co-create your dream with the quantum energy, with the universe, rather than we struggle doing it ourselves. Yeah. So this energy is quantum energy. Now we have a dream and create our future. This is limitless because we use our imagination. We use that energy. There is no time frame. You can you can plan for the next five years, but the energy can speed up, yeah? can speed up even faster to reach you, even bigger, because you co-create this with the universe. This is limitless. We are co-creating because we know there is a bigger power inside us the universe inside us and all this powerful energy inside us. Using our imagination, using our senses, using the color, because all the universe is actually energy and works on a frequency level. It's always move. All the energy around us is always moving. So this is another way to co-create our dreams that I would like to share with you. But here is the challenge. This is another one. This is you. And all the in the quantum field, all are unrealized potential here. 
is this infinite possibilities. We can create anything. We can dream anything. We can dream the, dream the impossible. What make it impossible is actually our mind we're thinking it's impossible. But now we challenge ourselves to dream the impossible. Because our mind that has limited us. So this is the blocking, the shield of us access, accessing the limitless possibilities, infinite possibilities. Our old belief, our old stories that we build about ourselves, we are not good enough, we experience this, we fail, we cannot be successful in this world, you know, all this carry a, a shield around us without we realize unconsciously. So we are conscious leaders. We are a community of conscious leaders. When we were a child, we create that dream. We were unconscious. I would like to invite you now to co-create your dream consciously by knowing that we are so powerful each one of us is so powerful and each one of us create our dream in this field quantum field and we can pick it up everybody pick that that energy and that intelligence into our body into our consciousness and we do this together And we don't ask how to reach our dream here. Because how is the question from our mind? And this, you just your, use your imagination, create it, put it out there. And then synchronicity will happen for us. Synchronicity that we meet the right people the right resources, the right investment at the right time coming to us. We don't, we need to chase. I remember in my corporate work, you know, always chase, chasing, 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 target performance and all these things and make us anxious and burn out. But this, we co-creating with the universe, with this quantum field, quantum energy together. So we are partnership. We have that partner. We are not alone. And this has been proven by scientific. There is a proof. You can access it in the Google, in the book, Dr. Uh, Jean Houston. Um, She's the one who's working on expanding human capacity. So if we reflect in each one of us, our capacity, in what level we are doing at the moment to create our dreams. A lot of reasons. Cannot do this. This is not the right time, no resources. You know, We can create that, but after that, we become small. Yeah. yeah. Criticism, judgment of your dream easily affecting us and make us small. We forget who we are. Therefore, I would like to invite you while we co-creating this dream at the same time, we clean up all this, all stories, all energy, you know, at the same time. So we can easily access to infinite possibilities. So it can be anything that we pay attention, attention to will become probabilities and become realities. And that is the process, how it materialize to make our dreams come true. Yeah. So this is an effortless, easy way. We trust, we clear this blocking shield, whatever it is in us. And we work with this 
universe, quantum energy to create our future, our dreams, whatever it is. You can do as big as possible, as well as possible. Don't go for a small dream. But you can practice it for a small dream because probably it, it's quicker to, to feel the result. Because if your dreams are so big, impossible, it takes time. Because we need to, universe need to wait for everybody, the energy level synchronized to be able to work together to reach this dream. So if you are in this community of leaders, then it's time because not everybody is in the same frequency and the same energy. It needs more time. That's where we need passion and trust that this or bigger things will happen to us. So we do the hygiene process, cleaning up all the limiting beliefs that we have, that we carry conditioning from our childhood that make us fear to dream again feel of fear of failure and all this condition yeah hygiene process you know so clear this up the energy from our body um i would like to go to straight to the process and i would like to invite you to join me in this process every one of us I assume are ready with our dream that you want to create during these two days. It's up to you. Maybe you want to have future dream. Maybe you want to renew your dream because your past dream was built maybe from the low frequency energy from scarcity from fear from anger you know sometimes we we have so upset with what's happening in the world that create our anger and we want to do this for the good of the humanity but even though that the intention is good you build the dream based on the lower frequency energy so we need to clear that I want to invite you now to think about or to feel what is that call you, what kind of dream you want to create for yourself, for your organization, for your community, and for the world, for the world. And anything that you create for yourself will affect the others because we are one. We are connected in this field in this quantum field of energy. So you may find that your dream has a similarity or synchronized with some others, a dream as well. Yeah, it's connected. Somebody called you and then, hey, I want to do this, 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 and connected. So that can happen. Speed up the process. Okay. So I would like to invite you to think about one dream that you want to work as the exercise of this later on after this you can do this exercise again but this one i would like to invite you just think about one dream that you want to do for this exercise and we are going to use our imaginations our senses our visualizations and movement because energy is always moving and we want to synchronize the energy of our body and the energy around us. Okay, are we ready? Yeah, faith say yes, I follow faith. <laughs> Fate's nodding, so okay, we are all ready, okay. So um, close your eyes, dreamers, leaders, my friends, Close your eyes. And I would like to invite you to connect with your breathing again. Take a deep breath in. 
and breathe it out. Another deep breath in, even deeper and slower. And breathe it out. Another deep breath in. Feel that and let it out. You feel that universe is inside you and we are part of the universe. So I want to connect, I want you to feel your brain, your mind, and your body and feel that presence at the moment. Now let's connect to this huge, huge, beautiful energy of the universe. When you breathe in, you connect the whole energy of your body with the energy of the universe. And when you breathe out, you stick back to your body. You expand and are coming back to your body. Expand and coming back to your body. So breathe in, connect your body to the energy of the universe in this quantum field and breathe out. Breathe in, connect even, expand in even further, even more expanding, even more powerful to the energy of the universe. And breathe out, back to your body. And breathe in, expand your energy to the universe. Expand far, far away. More powerful. Expand, expand, expand. Coming back to your body. And know that you are part of the universe that you are so powerful. I want to invite you now. This is the quantum field. I want you to imagine that you are sitting in a theater. In front of you, here's a big screen. A big screen. and there is movie there. I want you to click your dreams. You click that. And this is your dream coming into the screen. See that your dream, it's happening already. It's there already. Your project, whatever you want, your business, your project for this world, for this earth, for humanity. For, for those poor people, for the hunger, for the refugees. For the sustainability of whatever land, forest, mountain, water, sustainable resources for the people. Whatever the good cause that your heart connected to, see everything in the screen in front of you. It's done. It's done. See the people that benefit from your project. 
see all the smiles in the people feeling happy because of you, because of your dreams come true. See how the world become peaceful again. See everybody smile and give love to each other because of you, because of your dream, because of your project. See whatever it is. This is like your story on how you make your dream come through and it's reported back to you in the stream. It's done. Amazingly, it's done. Whatever your dream, big or small, see that already happened in this film. This film can be one minute, can be two minutes, can be five minutes. Depending the scale of the dream. Now I would like to invite you to step into that screen. Step into the screen that feel that you are in that screen in that film. Feel the energy there. How do you feel? Touch it. If it is a space, if it is a building, if it is the people that you help, touch them and feel them. Hug them. See the people around you who are there to support your dream. Are there familiar faces? Are there new people? Can you recognize the face and the name probably? Use your senses. I want you to smell this. To smell this, what does it smell? What does the smell of the success of having your dream become reality? Is it smells like roses? Is it a smell like a forest? Is it a smell like the raindrops? What does the smell feel? And taste it. What does it taste? Is it the yummy chocolate? It is the yummy strawberry? Taste it, taste it. Feel that. Use your senses and imagination. Who are you? Which part of the world you are now here? With these people, with this project, with this dream that has already been materialized. And now I would like you to use your hand, spread it out, and dance with this. Dance and move, and move and celebrate this. This beautiful quantum energy, it's, it's there with you, it's dance with you, it's synchronized with you. Everything is aligned with you, with who you are, why you are here in this world who you are, your true self, feel that dance, feel and dance and celebrate and make this movement. You, are, you have become the hero, the hero of all the people that you send this impact to. Celebrate and move and move. And feel this energy, 
Feel the fire, feel the celebration, feel the wind, smell the roses, smell the beautiful, whatever you feel, the, the air, the mountain, the forest, the ocean, the beach. Feel that energy in your heart and your body. Feel that joy, that gratefulness, that fulfillment, that happiness, that freedom. Only pure joy, only love. Everything is love. Now when you are done, I invite you to step back from the screen and back to the space where you are before and you are now. If you still feel that energy, Feel it. If you need time to take that energy with you, take it. But if you are ready, you can come back to this space, open the eye, your eyes with a smile, with a smile in your face. So after that, after we co-creating this, this dream, does it mean we just sit there and wait for something happen? Of course, we continue our work. We continue prepare, prepare ourselves, prepare our energy. Because if we tired, burn out, we will not do, be able to create this big dream. We need rest. We need restoration of our energy. We need hygiene process in our body so it can manifest fully for you. There's always a synchronization, a message coming to you to meet this person, to meet this one. Open your heart to be able to listen to this message that will guide you to the realization of your dream and carry that energy with you. It's not about how, but carry that energy, that imagination, that senses, all your sensory with you and build it up every day. So that's the practice. You can repeat it anytime you want. You can change your dream, of course, because the universe always change. The energy around us always change. And universe need us to create this dream to be created, right? We are work in progress and the same thing. Universe, this world is work in progress. So we co-create together. Universe depend on us to create the changes that we want in this planet, in this earth. So thank you. That's uh, my session. Um, I do hope this, maybe there's a connection with your heart. And if there is any questions, um, I'm here till if there is no time, then I can be connected anytime as well if you have any questions for me.